Hello friends, welcome to the Shrakshit channel. In today's video, a normal lunch routine vlog. Today I have prepared white rice, yam fry and some tomato dal. Today I am cooking white rice in a normal open vessel. Take the rice and here I washed rice for 2 to 3 times and kept aside. Meanwhile, I am going to boil the egg. And dropping the egg one by one while boiling the eggs add two tablespoon of rock salt so that we can peel the skin easily I'm adding dal into a pressure cooker washed it thoroughly in meanwhile water has boiled I'm adding rice if you're watching my channel for first time then do like share and subscribe I am adding 1 4 spoon of turmeric to the tur dal. I have taken 3 medium sized tomato chopping it and 1 medium sized onion. I am adding all the ingredients directly into the pressure cooker or you can even cook tur dal separate in the pressure cooker and then later you can uh, you can fry onion and tomato in the separate pan and later you can add the tur dal uh, cooked tur dal into the kadai here i am covering the rice with plate kept flame on medium adding onions into the pressure cooker mix it well meanwhile here i have soaked tamarind for 10 to 15 minutes for both uh, dal tomato and yam fry now adding 5 to 6 pots of garlic into the pressure cooker and 1 spoon of oil and pressure it under for 3 to 4 whistles until dal becomes mashy cons consistency. In meanwhile I am going to slice the yam. Before slicing the yam, here is a small tip for you. Apply 2 to 3 drops of coconut oil on your palm, rub it well so it prevents you from itching. Spread the newspaper or any tissue paper or kitchen cloth while slicing the yam because yam contains a lot of mud particles slice it well don't wash yam before slicing or in the middle you have to wash the yam completely after slicing slicing the yam because it increases the itchness more slicing take care of your hands because we have already applied the oil it may slit for you once completed the peeling the yam keep it aside and remove the dust particles and roll up in the newspaper or kitchen table or tissue paper and spread the new one and now cut the yam into whichever shape you like here I am slicing so it gives better taste when we better taste and shape when we fry it add into a bowl once you completed cutting the yam and then wash it thoroughly for 5 to 6 times because it contains a lot of mud particles in meanwhile egg is boiled i am removing the egg from from the stove same time I am checking out my rice still it has to be cooked into another vessel I am adding 250 ml of water and add 1 4 spoon of turmeric 1 spoon of chilli powder you can increase the quantity of chilli powder according to your taste and salt as per required Mix it well. Keep your flame on medium. And now add sliced yam pieces into the vessel. 
cook it for about 10 minutes until yams are 70% cooked add 3 tablespoons of tamarind pulp mix it well and allow it to cook here my rice is done I'm going to drain out the water. In meanwhile, my arm is seventy percent cooked. At this stage, turn off the flame and keep an iron tawa or any other. to heat once the pan or tawa is heated add 2 to 3 spoons of oil here i am going to shallow fry the yam now add the yam pieces one by one i am going to fry it batch by batch once yam pieces are placed on the tawa add one spoon of oil and here i am adding that water which we have cooked the yam pieces and let let it cook for 6 minutes on a medium flame until it turns crispy on the other pressure is released the da the dal has been cooked with the help of an masher mash it well and i'm i'm going to temper it take a kadai add 3 to 4 spoons of oil in meanwhile i'm turning out the yam slices after 3 minutes once oil is heated add 1 spoon of cumin and 1 spoon of mustard and allow it allow it to splatter here i have taken 5 to 10 pods of crushed garlic adding into the pan and 3 red chilli and some curry leaves and some hing or asafoetida fry until until garlic becomes golden brown in meanwhile i am added second batch of yam slices to shallow fry and add cooked tomato dal into the tempering and allow it to boil for 10 minutes on medium flame and add two spoons of tamarind pulp If you want you can even dilute with water Mix it well On side by side I am frying the yam slices also and transferring into a separate bowl and required amount of salt to the tomato dal and mix it well and transfer into a separate vessel or serving vessel and i have completed frying the yam slices after draining out the rice i have just kept the rice vessel on the flame for the 3 minutes here is my lunch white rice and yam fry and tomato dal is ready hope you like the video thanks for watching have a happy day don't forget to subscribe